Welcome to Lines to Go installation videos. Today we will be removing and installing transmission cooler lines on a 2013 Dodge Grand Caravan using Lines to Go part number TCL-123. While this particular installation is being performed on a 2013 Grand Caravan, this set of lines will also fit the following year, make, and models as shown on your screen now. Lines to go lines are made using original equipment and forms and fittings that are CNC bent for an easy and precise installation. We have also upgraded to stainless steel braided Teflon hoses for rust protection and to prevent surface fouling. These have an unlimited shelf life and anti-static PTFE liner. This set of lines to go lines are made from G2 Galfan coated steel tubing for rust resistance that exceeds OEM standards. Tech tip. Disconnect the battery before working on a vehicle to reduce the risk of shorting out the battery on tools or lines. Lines to go lines are made with a sectional design for easier installation. We also use color coded unions on our sectioned lines. Just match the colors at the connections. This vehicle does not come equipped with a transmission dipstick. To check the transmission fluid level, you will either need to purchase one from the dealer or have a mechanic check the fluid level. Tools required 10 mm wrench. 10 mm and 13 mm sockets and ratchet, flat blade screwdriver, pick, drain pan, lines to go disconnect tool part number 5834-01. The level of difficulty for this installation is considered to be easy. Start by disconnecting both battery terminals using a 10 mm socket. Use a 13 mm socket to remove the battery hold down bracket and remove it. Remove the battery from the vehicle. Use a flat blade screwdriver to remove the plastic clips that secure the wiring harnesses to the battery tray. Use a 13 mm socket to remove the nut and two bolts that secure the battery tray into position and remove the tray from the vehicle. At the front of the vehicle, use a flat blade screwdriver to remove the two plastic push clips at the top of the front grille. Use a 10 mm socket to remove the two bolts at the top of the front grille. Pull the grille back and remove the two bolts on either side of the upper radiator support. Note the two top central bolts do not need to be removed. Next, use a 10 mm socket or wrench to remove the two central forward facing bolts from the upper radiator support. Reposition the radiator support off to the side, noting the hood latch cable is still connected. At the top of the cooler, on the driver's side, remove the plastic rings from the quick connect fittings using a pick or screwdriver. Use the lines to go transmission line disconnect tool, part number 5834-01, to remove both transmission lines from the quick connect fittings in the cooler. Repeat the previous steps at the top of the transmission by removing the plastic rings and using the lines to go disconnect tool to remove the lines from the quick connect fittings. Remove both transmission lines from the vehicle.
To begin the installation of your new Lines to Go transmission cooler lines, start by installing the line labeled B into position. Connect the front of the line into the lower quick connect fitting on the cooler and replace the plastic ring. Connect the other end of the line into the passenger side quick connect fitting on top of the transmission and replace the plastic ring. Next, install the remaining lines to go transmission cooler line labeled A into position and connect the front of the line into the top connection in the cooler and replace the plastic ring. Connect the other end of the line into the driver's side fitting on top of the transmission and replace the plastic ring. Replace the upper radiator support back into position, making sure the hood latch cable is routed correctly. Use a 10mm socket or wrench to replace the six bolts that secure the radiator support. Replace the two plastic push clips at the center of the grill. Replace the two bolts on either side of the grill using a 10mm socket. Reinstall the battery tray into position and use a 13mm socket to replace the nut and two bolts. Secure the wiring harness to the tray using the plastic push clips. Install the battery into position and secure the battery hold down bracket using a 13 mm socket. Reconnect both battery terminals using a 10 mm wrench. With the vehicle running in park on a flat level surface, check the transmission fluid level. Top the fluid up as required. Note, this vehicle does not come with a transmission fluid dipstick. To check your fluid level, you will either need to purchase a dipstick from the dealer or have a certified mechanic check the level. This concludes the installation of transmission cooler lines on a 2013 Grand Caravan using lines to go part number TCL-123. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or would like to purchase the lines you saw today, please call us at 1-855-781-5992, email us at info at linestogo.com, or check out our website link below. And don't forget to take advantage of our free two-day shipping. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button below, and we will see you on our next video.